Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about how to reset or disable your class code for a, any given Google Classroom. So what you want to do is find a classroom that you want to do this to, um, and then you're going to go up into the top right hand corner and click on the gear looking icon, and that's going to open up this class settings page for you. Then you're going to scroll down until you get to the general section, and you'll notice the first um, option is class code. And if you go over to the right side, it has your current class code. So if you click on the down button, it's going, or the down arrow, it's going to give you some options. It's going to allow you to display it. So it'll do it nice and large for you. Uh, it's also going to allow you to copy it. So if you wanted to use it in email or you just needed to put it in a document, that's a nice option. But the two that we're going to focus on is the reset. So if you click on this, what it's going to do is it's going to take your code, which um, this one's currently B6C7W3D, and it's going to change it. So that's a nice option if you have um, students who are younger and can't um, read it as easily, like there's you know, I's or L's and they might think it's a different letter. That's a nice option. But it's also a nice option if you um, want to change it because you don't want someone else getting into the, cl into the uh, classroom um, by someone else giving them the code. Um, the, another option is if you click that down arrow again is disable. And what this does is it turns off your class code so that no one else can enter into this classroom. Only the people who are there can be there. Um, it doesn't disable the whole class, just the code. So those are a couple options that you have with your class code. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on how to disable and reset your class code.